Such events might help inspire another child's passion for astronomy. Witnessing exciting celestial events as a child, such as the Great Comet of 1744 and the Solar Eclipse of 1748, stimulated Frenchman Charles Messier's lifelong interest in astronomy. His passion for observing led him to work in Paris as a depot clerk for the official astronomer of the French Navy, a job that entailed using an observatory on the roof of the Hôtel de Cluny. Messier had ample time to observe, as well as a good dark sky observing location in pre-industrial revolution Paris. His early passion was comet hunting. He was among the first astronomers to verify the predicted return of Halley's Comet in 1758-1759. During the search, he discovered another comet and a comet-like streak of light in the constellation Taurus. Unlike a comet, however, this smudge didn't move relative to the stars. He made a note of it. As he continued hunting comets over the next decade, he encountered one fuzzy, cloud-like nebula after another, giving each a designation of the letter M followed by a number. Some, like M22, which had been discovered in 1665, could barely resolve as a circular cluster of huge numbers of closely packed stars, later called globular clusters. Others, like M31, had an elongated shape and had been previously recognized as a great nebula in Andromeda. Many were objects that Messier himself was the first person to discover and describe. 